experiences who could relate to going with whatever it is that she was dealing with. But because we still have yet to hear what that surgery was, it leaves again a vacuum that people are filling with lots of speculation. What is your opinion mm -hmm. on how all these crazy theories um, are eroding the public's trust and even their trust in credible news sources? As a crisis communication strategist, I do not look at any of these theories as conspiracy theories. When the public starts asking questions, it means there are holes in the story that need to be filled. That is what's happening here. This is not about the internet run wild. This is not about the internet taking the fault or the blame. The royal family is acting like the Wild West right now, and there isn't any type of planning or transparent communication that is coming out of the palace. So how will it end?